Did you used to feel a bit isolated when you were younger? Yes, I did. To a point where I only discussed my sexuality with my mom in 2019 after that Heels performance on Strictly. So you can imagine that barrier. And it hasn't been great. And how we actually ended up talking about it was because a friend of mine was murdered. And she came home and she said, did you hear about Bully? I said, yes, did you hear why it happened? Um, and she said, no. I said, because it, it was a homophobic attack. And she was lost for words. And I said, it's sad because that could have happened to me because I'm gay. You know, we've never, ever, ever fully spoken about it. So there were lo- there's, there's also lots of my life's experience that I haven't shared with the people that I really, really, really love, you know, which is my family. And hence why I've also been skeptical about getting into relationships with other men. You know, mm. I think, <laughs> you know, I could never be in a position where yeah, just to trust somebody like that with everything about my life. So yes, um, yeah, it has, as you can imagine, I'm saying like I'm grown now and I'm seeing things differently. And yeah, I'm in a position to speak to my mom about everything now in my life. But the truth of the matter is there's parts of my life that I've never lived out there. You know, I don't know how to put it, but I've never been, yeah, there's lots that people don't know about me. Mm. And I've just had to be okay with that. Do you think getting to that position where you can be your true self, your mum, especially, and feel that level of acceptance enables you to process, say, the hate that you come up against at different points a bit easier in a way? And does it help you to compartmentalise it in a way? I think you, 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 you're on the money there when you say you need to, to compartmentalise because, honey, <laughs> there's no other way to deal with it, you know? In a world where I, like, I mean, I always say when I go to work, because of my skin colour, I have to be excellent, you, you know, at, at, at whatever it is that I do or else people don't take me seriously. <laughs> that's, just, that's just my reality, you know what I'm saying? I've constantly had to prove myself. I had to create a world where <laughs> I'm okay with me if you understand the decisions that I make in my life and things that make me happy, I know what love is. And my family has never been ashamed of who I am. And yes, because, you know, I never had to go out seeking for validation from the outside. So Johannes has always been okay because I know where's my place of refuge and I know who's my people, right? And my family is, is the best is the best I tell you, but I've had to really walk away from my family to establish a life for myself. Um, Sometimes I think the things that happen in my life now, they can't, they don't even understand the magnitude of it. (laughs) If you understand what I'm saying, and just not because everything is just, it's not their world. So you can imagine I had to really get out of that township and, and build a world for myself. 